When you're playing Chopin's Etude, Op. 25, number one, with small hands, you want to rotate instead of stretching and let go of notes after you play them. You'll also want to experiment with the fingerings for the middle notes. Try to see whether two or three or even four feels better in between. I don't recommend using five to five because that really breaks up the line and it's going to be more trouble than it's worth. There are a couple of places where you can let one hand help the other, and I'll show you where those are. And then let me show you a couple of fingering spots that I found to be helpful too. It's a good idea to start this with simplified practice so that you have a melodic idea and you can make musical decisions from the very beginning of working on the piece. So for measures one through four, you might play something like this. Right hand. 
hand plays the F, and the left hand plays the E flat. In measure 33, you can switch to the right and left thumbs in the first beat and the last beat. So the right hand plays F,